Alright, so boom. It was October 18th, 1991, live from Atlantic City, New Jersey, where the newly crowned reigning defending undisputed 17-0 undefeated newly crowned WBO World Heavyweight Champion Ray Mercer in his very first title defense took on the 28-0 undefeated Tommy Morrison. You think you can do this to me? Billed as the test of courage, the 22-year-old phenom Tommy Morrison tried to take the title away from Olympic gold medalist Ray Mercer. In the first round, the Olympic gold medalist was getting outboxed. No matter how many punches he thrown, it either got blocked or left no damage on Tommy Morrison. Do something, you little bitch. <laughs> Had the champion looking completely outmatched out there, as Morrison would completely dominate him in the first round. Balcom punch! If Mercer was wearing a toupee, that hair would have been in the front row. Into the second round we'd go and Morrison tried to detach Mercer's head from his neck. Despite the fact that Mercer didn't take as much damage as he did in the first round, that man landed absolutely no offense. Die! Oh, you can Mans was eating uppercuts all evening. If Morrison keeps whipping his ass like this, he's gonna take not only the title, but his gold medal as well. Mercer was able to connect on a couple of baby hooks, but to no avail, he'd lose the second round as well. Into the third we go. Do it again. This man took an uppercut every round. His chin filed a grievance against his brain. Another one. Finish him. Die! Help me! I don't know if the ray on his trunk stands for Ray Mercer or Ray Charles. This man can't see a glove coming towards his face. He's been dominated through three rounds, and now it's looking like it's desperation time for the champion. <laughs> Vicious right hand to close the round. Into the fourth we go, the champion trying to build some momentum. Ow, fuck you. <laughs> Ow. Turns out Mercer finally picked up the controller. He let the NPC play the first three rounds. Look at me. Shut the fuck up, you cunt! I'm the captain now. Use a bitch. Come at me, bro! All those uppercuts Mercer was eating through the first three rounds reminded him he was an Olympic gold medalist. And finally, we have ourselves a fight. Come here. You do well! <laughs> you do well! And for the remainder of the fourth round, it exchanged rights and lefts, but this round clearly goes to Ray Mercer. <laughs> Brother got hit in the face so much, he might have to go fetch his front teeth. Speaking of fetch... And now a word from our sponsors. It's the second month of the year. Time to kick it into high gear with Fetch Rewards. Fetch Rewards is a super easy to use free app where you can earn free rewards on literally anything that you buy. Scan any receipt or e-receipt and you'll earn points no matter where you shop or what you buy. You then redeem those points and receive hundreds of rewards, including Amazon and Visa gift cards. But keep in mind, receipts can't be older than two weeks, so make sure you scan your receipts expeditiously. The reason why I use Fetch is because of their speed, they're extremely easy to use, their reward options, and I can get points from literally anywhere. From any retail store, all Amazon purchases, darn near every single one of my e-receipts, and all of the restaurants possible. We're only two months into the new year, so make sure you start in your 2022 right. Click those links in my description, download the Fetch app today, use promo code CHISELED, you receive 3,000 points when you scan your very first receipt. That's promo code CHISELED, you'll receive 3,000 points when you scan your very first receipt on the Fetch app. Get receipt rich today, the Fetch way. And now back to your regularly scheduled program. Round five, fight. Die! You missed your last chance. You'll regret that forever. Oh lord, this man Morrison got finished with a 15-piece combo in the corner. Homie was taking more headshots than victims of the DC sniper. Took more rights and lefts than a driving test. He too got jumped by one man. The combination had this brother looking like he was struggling to swim. Look at his arms. He may be in the ring with an Olympic gold medalist, but he thought it was the 50-meter freestyle relay. What the hell was the referee looking at? Why'd he let him get pieced up like that that long? Right hand landed flush on the temple, had him confused, and then murdered.
Mercer unleashed a fury as if Morrison was responsible for Rodney King's beating seven months prior. Morrison's hands were disconnected from his body, his face unprotected, taking all kinds of gloves. Just look at it in real time. Ray Mercer transmogrified into Monkey D. Luffy and hit his opponent with a gum gum gatling gun. <laughs> Homie was down doggy near the bottom rope. I don't think there's been a more devastating combination finish in boxing history. Morrison was up three to one entering the fifth round and then Mercer said, you haven't even seen my final form. It's as if he went super saiyan. Morrison might as well have gotten beaten by the mafia wielding bats. His noggin is taking a flogging. He got the Michael Jackson nose without even needing surgery. He gonna need to see the orthodontist cause that brother gonna need a dental plan. Lisa needs braces. Beat the brakes off that brother. He gonna need a Sinzu bean. Where's the full restores when you need them? Somebody activate Monster Reborn. Recovery girl should have been here five minutes ago. Inject this brother with the Titan Serum. Call Nurse Joy. Get that brother to the Pokemon Center. He need a medic. Somebody please go to goddamn EMT. Finish him. And welcome to your first day in the afterlife.